Anita Mosby is now the socio-economic advisor for ExxonMobil. She was a new graduate straight out from the University of Papua New Guinea when she was given the opportunity by ExxonMobil to explore the flora and fauna along the LNG corridor. We knew or I knew the, the possibility of finding a new species, either be a frog or a, um, or a plant species, was there. But to have one named after me, no, um, it, I, I didn't expect it. A world-renowned frog specialist, Steve Richards, who leads the biodiversity monitoring efforts on behalf of the PNG LNG project, named the frog after Mosby in recognition of her efforts. Dr. Steve Richards was, was saying um, in his etymology, and um, he said that uh, he named the frog after me because of my contributions to supporting the monitoring surveys. But what he told me was that he named the frog after me because the frog couldn't stop talking. I think he has it. <laughs> Her interest in the PNG biodiversity started at an early age, having a father who was an agriculturalist. And so he used to bring a lot of seeds in and you know, try, try them out in, in our local, I mean, in the backyard garden. And if the yield was good, he would go and distribute to his farmers and all that. So that, as a, as a child growing up, seeing him do that, sort of grew with a passion for science in me. Although a bit shy in front of our camera, Anita is a very outgoing person and a few minutes with her at Nature Park and we were intrigued by her wealth of knowledge of the biodiversity there. She has this advice for kids aiming to explore PNG's biodiversity. Always be intrigued. Um, you don't get questions when you get an answer. When you ask a question and you get an answer, don't get it at face value. Go and research about it. Like for me, when I was growing up and going to school, I had um, I had to go to the library and there were encyclopedias that I had to go and read up and look. But now, like, kids have, have a mobile phone and they can, they can easily go online and go to Encyclopedia Britannica and look up things. Or they can easily go to YouTube and watch some good TED Talks and you get more information. Biodiversity monitoring for the PNG LNG project has led to several discoveries of new fauna and flora species, including the frog Copula mosbae, the damselfly Nososisca morginae, and a new plant species named after ExxonMobil, Distriantes ExxonMobilensis. Shamin Poreambep, National MTV News.